Hi, good morning. So we are on Port St. George now. I was told that Tobago has been the most fought for, for island in historical times. It changed hands between the English, the Dutch and the French. Because of its prime geological location. Right now we are standing on top of Rampart and you can see multiple guns aimed at towards the sea to take down the enemy as their ships as they are coming from the sea. Here with me I have my tour guide. Captain Phillips. Captain Phillips. And we have a lady who's trying to hide. <laughs> So this is where they kept their gunpowder and you can see that this whole construction is buried within these four walls, deep below ground level so that they cannot be attacked so easily and at the same time it can also be kept dry and we are now walking towards the door, towards the entrance to one of these places where the gunpowder was stored. It's pitch dark now, there's nothing inside. But you can see something. Yeah. There. Now they've kept some lamps inside. But this is where the gunpowder was stored. This is the front. Behind there's another one. And you can see this, these are the rampart walls which protect the powder magazine. This was built by the French in 1783. And they used it from 1783 to 1793. We are walking around it. This is on the left-hand side of the picture. We have the powder magazine. On the right side, we have the rampart walls, which protect it. And we are walking on the passage in between the two. Here we can see some small ventilation shafts. And this is the ventilation shaft, which of course has been closed over by now. Now we have walked on one side. Now we are at the back and again there's a rampart wall in front of us and you can see these are the footholds where the soldiers can climb and watch to see if any other enemy soldiers are coming from the other side. And on the left hand side we have still the powder magazine and there's another door in the back which opens into another powder magazine storage space which of course as usual is empty right now. And this is the interior of that. Now it's got only pigeon droppings and you can see the pigeon droppings here. This is the interior where they stored their gunpowder because this that was their lifeblood. Without the gunpowder, there were nothing. And now we are on the third wall, and now we have turned the corner and we are at the fourth wall. Again, the powder magazine is on the left hand side, and the rampart wall is on the right hand side. We are walking on the fourth side. So, this is the full tour of the powder magazine. Interesting, huh? There again, you can see the powder magazine, and this is the entrance to the powder magazine. You can see it is below ground level. It is considerably below ground level.